What's up, everybody? We're back. Power Pals is with you. I'm Mike. This is Cole. Mm -hmm. um, the baseball season has started, and so far, our Buckos off to a little bit of a slow start. One and three. Um, before we get started, I have to acknowledge something. Uh, in the past couple uh, videos we've uploaded, I've been mentioning last year in our predictions that the Pirates were 81 and 80 last year. They were not. They were actually 82 and 79. Shame on me for not knowing that and not giving proper credit to our team. But in doing so, I think now that I'm going to change my prediction from 87 wins this year to 88 and still make the playoffs, obviously. So, uh, Cole? All right. We've been gone for a little while. We know. You know, we've been gone for a little while because what we what we did is there's two games in Cincinnati. The third one got canceled, and then another short two series for the Pirates opener. And we're just going to do a combined, and then they're playing uh, at home Cincinnati against Cincinnati for four games. So we just thought we'll do the two and two, combine them, and... Uh, there you go. And then we'll get back at you this Sunday after the Cincinnati series. So, okay, let's talk about the first, uh, the opener of the year in Cincinnati. Um, I thought uh, we split the series 1-1, which wasn't bad. Uh, the starting pitching, I think, looked real good. Jameson Tyne looked excellent uh, the first game. Ran a little bit of trouble uh, in the seventh inning. Um, but the second game, Trevor Williams just looked outstanding, and uh, the bullpen looked good there too. So, you know, we had one good game, one bad game. Uh, then we came home, the home opener, and yesterday's game, not the kind of outcome we really wanted. We, we dropped both of them. I think we gave both of those games away. What, what do you think, Cole? I mean, just the bullpen definitely needs some work, yeah. especially those two series. Uh, series just... Losing both times in uh, extra innings is yeah, pretty painful. That's tough. Um, you know, especially in the, in the St. Louis series too. I mean, again, we got some really good starting pitching from pitching from Archer and Tylen again, and um, you know the bullpen kind of let us down. So we definitely got some work to do uh, the back ha half of the uh, of the uh, pitching staff, but uh, you know it's still early in the season, so. Um, what we got coming up is a uh, four-game homestand here in Cincinnati. It would be great to see them, uh, you know, go 3-1 and one at the very least, get back to 500. Um, but there were some bright spots over the past four days, uh, the first four games. Um, what, did, what, did you, what were your takeaways, positive and negative, from the first two series? First two series. So, for positives? Can I start with positive yes. first? Yeah, sure. I'll start with positive. Positives, I like the starting pitching, of course, like the starting pitching. The hitting, again, is not bad, just that we need to get some work done. Uh, and honestly, I'm not, that's honestly, that's all. That's all. And um, then the well, the one thing I do, I, they battled back. I mean, the fact that, you know, they had a lead and let the teams get, you know, their opponents get back into it, but they fought back and actually had chances in extra innings to win these games, too. So... That's, I guess that's a positive. Um, you know, the other thing that, that frustrated me a lot was we probably really didn't need to be in those situations. I mean, I even look at the game. We won 5-0 in Cincinnati, and that game probably should have been 10-0. The biggest problem I see right now is we are doing what? We're leaving runners in scoring position. Um, last last game, uh, we... Uh we were one and fourteen in uh, runners in scoring positions. Yeah, I mean you can't you know go one for fourteen <laughs> and, and have runners in scoring position and you know win at win games. Um, so yeah, they, they, we got some a little bit of work to do. I mean that always seems to be a, a problem with the Pirates, the, the clutch hitting. Um, so hopefully, but here's a positive: Jung Ho Gung hit the, hit a home run. So um, you know that the power we were talking about, Gung, maybe it's there. Um, it was a nice little bomb he cracked out of the park. Uh, on a down note, in this upcoming Cincinnati series, we just found out Corey Dickerson. Yes, apparently uh, he had a shoulder sprain, I guess, and mm -hmm. he's uh, now day to day. Yeah, well, he, he could be out for almost up to a month, so that's better. I got one thing about uh, Clint Hurdle I got to get off my chest. <laughs> And a uh, long-time subscriber, uh, Steve McDonald, might disagree with me on this one. But, um, yeah, the, 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 I talked about 
to be successful is, is um, dealing with your strengths and you know playing to your strengths. And he, I really think the Pirates need to play more small ball. And something I guess just doesn't happen anymore is bunting. Uh, yesterday, Adam oh, yes. Frazier, well, Adam Frazier, the first oh, thing, led right. off with a double. So you got a guy on second base, no outs. I know Marte's up, but I would love to see Marte bun the third and make that sacrifice. And someone like with Marte speed, he might even, you know, make it the first. And then you got a situation where early game, first inning, a ground ball, they're going to go for two. The run's going to score. You know, even if Marte doesn't get out, if it's a, if it's a softly hit ground ball, that runner is going to score from third. Anything out of infield, that runner is going to score from third. So I just don't want to see the manufacture runs. And again, yesterday in the ninth inning with the tie scored, um, you know, uh, I think it was Gonzalez gone Gonzalez. first. He, they, he walked. I think he stole second, and when that was a, that was a bit of a controversial call, but it, he was safe. Uh, it was just a poor about, tag. Can we talk about that? Uh, he took an awkward base path. Yes, he did. That's like, a good he went observation. inside and then back in. Like, yeah. it was so weird, but hey, he was safe, so I don't care. And then So, this, so we're, we're two pitches in, and, and, and uh, the first, uh, once he got on, Pablo Reyes was up, and he's showing bunt. So now you got a guy on second base with only two pitches. The count was one on one. Now you're not going to bunt him to third. I mean, you get that you know, the game winning run at third base if you bunt him over and they pull back and he strikes out. Just like when Marte in the first thing, instead of bunting, he struck out. Anyways, I would love to see Clint try a little more small ball. What do you got, Dad? Cool, anything? I mean, I I mean, I finished my positives. Didn't get to go on my negatives. Uh, I apologize. <laughs> well, what were your negatives? My negatives were, uh, of course, again, Steve. Sorry, but small ball. It it needs it, it. It just needs. We need to do it basically. Uh, some of the our hitters. I mean, they can be a little bit better, and uh, just the basic uh, infield errors, like in yeah. home opener. Not home opener. Yeah, in the home opener, uh, Gonzalez. Oh, routine, yes. routine, routine ground. I forgot ground all ball. about that. Yeah, that's something you, you got to make. I mean, that that made a difference in the game too. Mm -hmm. I mean, Tied, so, they tied it up, right? Yeah, defense. I mean, defense. Mm -hmm. I mean, you need you know our infield is seems to be a little suspect, and obviously the you know the bullpen, uh, they definitely need to improve. Um, that so far has been the difference. I mean, we've got great starting pitching, and the bullpen was supposed to be part of the strength of the team and they have not come through for us so far aside from this 5 nothing victory in Cincinnati. So, hey, on a plus note, I'm heading down to the game ballpark tomorrow, so I promise you to bring, it, bring home a win and then yours truly, we're heading down Sunday. So, we, we go there, we're going to get to at least two wins, right? <laughs> Possibly. We're going to uh, try and uh, maybe film a bit of the park game yeah, yeah. on Sunday. So we'll be down at PNC Park, and uh, we'll get a little uh, video of the game. Hopefully, you know, not hopefully, we will be bringing home a victory. So, hey, thanks, everybody, for tuning in again. Make sure you hit the subscribe and like button and comment on all of our videos. It helps us and see what we're doing wrong or correctly. And let's, let's go, go box. box.